Shocking story we have been following since Friday night. Now a Carnival cruise ship has returned to Galveston days after a woman fell overboard. Now investigators, including the FBI, are looking into what happened to Texas resident Samantha Broberg. Channel 2 Sion Rose live press in Galveston where the ship returned this morning with more on what's really become a mystery, Sion. And the Carnival Liberty behind me set to set, excuse me, will set sail in just about 30 minutes from now, even as the FBI is now investigating what happened to Samantha Broberg. Some passengers left the Carnival Liberty Monday morning still upset as they recalled their last few days on board the cruise. It's horrible. The ship was on its way to Cozumel Friday morning when a frantic search began for 33 year old Samantha Broberg. They put everyone on lockdown, made everyone go to their rooms and stay in there and they came through and did a ship wide search. Later that evening, the captain made a grim announcement. We have now concluded a review of our cameras and unfortunately it appears she may have fallen into the water early this morning. In a statement, Carnival told Channel 2, quote, sitting on a cruise ship railing is akin to sitting on the balcony railing of a high rise hotel. It is risky and dangerous and against our rules. As far as foul play, there is none suspected and the camera footage shows no indication of foul play. Still, the ship's next set of passengers said they weren't going to let the mysterious death affect their trip. No concerns or I wouldn't be here today. And the Coast Guard spent this weekend searching about 200 miles of the Gulf of Mexico, but they called off their search on Sunday. Reporting live in Galveston, Sion Rhodes, KPRC Channel 2 News.